Hi guys, this is a Toyota Prius C. It's been around for about 10 years and I've been using this car for some time and uh, you can pick one of these up quite cheap. Today I'd like to talk about what I think about this car. First of all, the exterior design of this car looks pleasant. It looks, uh, I wouldn't say very beautiful, but it's, it's good enough. Even by today's standard, I think it still looks quite sleek, quite uh, good. However, the interior design looks really cheap way too cheap for a car this price you know when this car first came out the full cost of this car is 150,000 that was a lot of money but with government subsidy and tax exemption it was about 95 to 100,000 which was still a lot of money so looking at the design of this car especially the interior it was very disappointing for a car that cost that much so I never uh, liked this car particularly until recently I picked one up and uh, started driving. Now I'm quite impressed with the way it drives. Um, it's quite low to the ground and it feels very steady. The steering wheel feels very nice, cornering very well, very precise, and it feels heavy too. Um, it's got enough zip, not particularly fast. Uh, it's got this echo mode, which I don't like. Once you press that on, it's very sluggish. Uh, it's horrible driving, but without the echo mode, it, it's quick enough. If you drive in the city, it's not meant to be a fast car. It's meant to be economical on petrol, which I think it achieves very well. Uh, especially when you're inching your way in traffic jam, you really saves a lot of petrol. But if you drive fast, it consumes petrol just like any other little cars without a hybrid system. Now it's got a um, 1.5 four-cylinder engine paired with CVT transmission and a hybrid system that comes on when the battery is charged and it's at slow speed. It's got the battery at the back, um, which needs to be changed in less than 10 years or if you in good luck maybe you can use up to 10 years or more and considering how much this car should cost you can today pick it up very very cheap I don't think it's a bad idea if you know the car is in good condition and the battery has just been replaced why not I mean if you take good care of it you probably can last at least eight or nine years with the battery and uh, the servicing could be expensive when you need to replace the battery. Maybe it will cost six or seven thousand to replace the battery. But if the battery has just been replaced, I don't think it's a bad idea at all. So honestly, I kind of like the way it drives and I, I enjoy driving it. And I love the fact that it saves a lot of petrol. And uh, if you have one of these, share with me what you think. Uh, you have any uh, problem with this car uh, for now? It, it's still fine with me, so thank you for watching.